it is. Let's see if it works. So I'm gonna put some Mountain Dew in here. They say your your first drink is supposed to be a hard water, um, basically meaning alcohol, which I don't normally drink, so we're not doing alcohol today. There we go. Got some Mountain Dew in there. Toast. Let's see. Let's see how the pour spout works. That works pretty good. Ah. Mm. Good old Mountain Dew heartburn. <clears throat> Alright, so there it is. You guys just witnessed me take my first drink out of my very first attempt at a Kuxa. Kuxa, yeah, I think it's called a Kuxa. Uh, like a Kuxa. Some people call it a Kuxa. A Kuxa. Whatever. A K-U-K-S-A. Uh, Kuxa. Um, there's another, uh, I think it's Swedish or I can't remember. You guys can look it up. They also call it a Gooksy or a Gooksa. I don't know. A different people call it different things like here in America we'd call that a cup all right it's a wooden cup um, but anyways they have a lot of different designs some of them will have a fancy little handle like a it basically will look like a measuring cup and you know looking it up online looking at all the different designs I'm like most of those will just look like a wooden measuring cup to me um, I think there's a company out there called Kuxa or Kuxa and they have their original, it's kind of like this one, but it has like two finger holes in the, the handle part. This one's probably not quite as tall as theirs. I would say theirs is probably considerably taller since they have two holes in it. And basically, kind of the idea behind making this is where if you put it down, it's kind of bottom heavy. So it doesn't just fall over and spill. It will try to upright itself and stay upright like that. And I actually done pretty good on this one. Uh, it does, you know, it can lean to the side, but it tries to, you know, flop back up onto the, the bottom, onto the flat. So that's pretty cool. Um, but yeah, my brother kind of challenged me uh, in one of my previous videos where I was carving I believe it was this right here, this scoop, which I'm still not done with. Um, so when I was doing that on that video, he commented and said I should try to make a kuksa. I didn't know what they were. So I had to look it up and that's when I discovered uh, it's a Northern Scandinavian tribes traditional cup. Uh, and that tribe's name is the Sami. So that's where that came from. That's the history behind it. Um, I would imagine they probably had some kind of decorative uh, lanyard or something on this and that way they could hang it from their belt. I don't really know. That's just my guess, right? Uh, but anyways, guys, I hope you liked the video. If you did, please smash that thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. And as always, we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching and we'll see you later. Bye.